Hello everyone, it's me Chebby from Inic Tutorials. Today, in this video, I'll show you how to copy all your Android smartphones SMS to your Windows computer. So, without any further more delay, let's begin. So, right now, on your Raspberry Windows computer, firstly, what you need to do is just open any web browser, and in the Google search, just search for one application name as My Phone Explorer, and on the first list, you will see its official website. Just click on it. So now you can see its official website. So here you can see a download option for Windows and even it's available in the Google Play Store also. So I will show you in the latter part how you can download and install on your respective Android smartphones. So firstly, we'll download for our respective computer that is for Windows. So let me click on it. So now just click on this download option. So finally the file has been downloaded. So let me go to the folder where it is being downloaded and let me close this web browser. So just double click it to run this software installer. Click on OK. Click on I agree. So here you can install it as a portable version also. So I will select this portable installation. If you want to install on your hard disk then you can just untick it. But right now I will use a portable installation. That means I will not install it directly on my hard drive. So you can either choose for a portable installation or without selecting this option also you can click on next. So wait for a few seconds. So finally our software has been installed successfully. So before running the software now on our Android smartphones just open the Play Store and in the Play Store just search for one application name as My Phone Explorer Client to search this application and click on install to install this application so finally our application has been installed successfully now on your windows computer just run this software that is my phone explorer and now on your android smartphone just run the my phone explorer client click on continue click on allow Click on allow, allow all the permissions. So we have allowed all the permissions. So on your Android smartphone, you will see under this application, there are tons of options. So the first option is using a Wi-Fi, using a Bluetooth, second option, and the third option is using a USB data cable also. So here for the first option if you choose the Wi-Fi connection then you need to connect with the same internet connections that is the same Wi-Fi internet connections both in your Android smartphone as well as in your Windows computer also and in case of Bluetooth both your Windows computer as well as your Android smartphone should have a Bluetooth and the third option that is using a USB data cable you can directly plug in in your Windows computer and you can directly sync or access all your SMS data from your Android smartphone to the, your Windows computer. So here I'm gonna use the third option USB cable plugin. So my Android smartphone is being already plugged in using a USB data cable right now. So on your computer just click on this file option and let's go to the settings. So under the settings, you will see here under the connection option on the right side, you will see your phone type, what type of phone you're using. So right now I'm using with a phone with Google Android OS. So let us select this first option. And now after selecting, you can see connect via Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, USB cable, or even IP addresses are also available. This is almost same with the Wi-Fi entry connection. So here you can either select the auto detect also, but right now, I'll just choose this USB cable. You can auto detect also if you want to choose to the auto detect also. So I've selected USB cable. So if you want to use a Bluetooth, then select this Bluetooth. And if you want to use the Wi Fi, then select this Wi Fi. Then after that, click on OK. Now, here you can see a sync icon that is synchronized icon. Just click on it. Now, you can see on the my phone explorer client on your android smartphone already you can see here the green 
text appearing connected via USB cable. So on your computer, it's asking to give a name. So just let me give a name, Samsung. I'll click on OK. Now it will start synchronizing and on your Android smartphone, it's asking for permission. Just tap on allow. Now it will synchronize everything from your Android smartphones. So the synchronization has been completed. So now on the left panel, you can see messages, right? Just click on it. So here you can see different messages. So you can select the inbox also if you want to select the inbox or a conversations everything so here i will select the inbox so here i have tons of sms already present on my android smartphones so in order to copy all this sms present on your android smartphones to your respective windows computer what you need to do is just click on any one of the messages and after that on your computer keyboard just press ctrl a to select all the SMS and after that just right mouse click and now you will see here export or import export selected messages just click on it now you can select your location where you want to export or copy or backup your SMS so I've selected a desktop click on save now it has been backup here so now you might be thinking how to open this exported or the backup sms files on your windows computer so for this just open a notepad application on your raspberry windows computer and just drag this exported file now you can click on file you can save as whatever type of sms you want to save so finally we have copied as a text so Using these cool tricks, you can easily copy all your Android smartphones SMS to your Windows computer very easily. So if you never known about these cool tricks, then you should definitely give it a try. So if you find this video tutorial useful, please click on the thumbs like button. And if you're new to our channel, click on the subscribe button. And lastly, thanks for watching.